Now, in the Paso Doble, we use the very important appell into promenade and counter promenade runs. Now we continue into twists. Now into group one. And now with our slow teaching count. Ready? And, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and eight, and one, two, three, and four, five, six, and seven, eight, and one. And we break this group down and commence with a quick appell into the promenade to end with a pivot. Ready? And, and one two, three. We continue into steps one to nine of the promenade and counter promenade runs in samba with the Paso Doble feeling. Ready? And four and five, six and seven, eight and one. Now we continue into two sets of twists to end right foot forward outside partner. And two, Three and four, five, six and seven. Now the man will take two steps turning to his right into a low press line, the lady turning on one foot in the opposite direction. Ready? And, and eight. And you can hold this for one or more beats. With the slow motion view, we can study exactly how the posture is so different in the Paso Doble to the other dances. Now please look here at the pickup of hold, the determination, the focus, and now the shaping of the bodies to create the Paso Doble positioning. Here we follow through from the promenade runs into the twist action and notice the body shaping again to create enlargement of posture and the true character of the dance. And look at this body shaping through the Spanish lines. One of the figures used by nearly every advanced dancer is the chassis capes. Now into group two. Let's take it again with our slow count. Ready? And one, two, and three, and four, and five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, six, and seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, and one. We break the group down for you one more time. So we start with the quick chassis. Ready? And one, two, and three, and four, and five. We step through six and close with double lapel seven. Now we dance this single beat chassis cape action with the ladies développé. Ready? And eight, one, two, three. 
Now we dance the chassis cape and the lady to continue. Four and five and six and seven. The chassis cape action and eight and one. The crossover and untwist and two, three, four. Now the Cuban break action and five and six, seven, eight and one. Slowly we can see the setup and attention to the togetherness at the start of the group. Please study the body shaping that Slavic creates now through the slight rotation of his upper body and the hip positioning. You can see that beautiful Spanish look with the matador's chin that's created by the shape. Now study Karina's leg action as she dances this type of chassis cape and again the change of posture to create a different character. And again here the use of the bodies in the twist action and the difference here from man to lady to the ending to create the femininity for Karina and the masculinity for Slavic.